Well, howdy, everybody. Made a trip to Walmart today with a wife and uh, made a few good finds, so I thought I'd share them with you. This is the Backwoods of a Magazine. Uh, I used to be subscribed to them. The subscription ran out, but I still go by to make sure and pick up a copy every two months. If you're into uh, prepping, bushcraft, Hiking, camping, survival, there's all kinds of ideas. And you're, you're a do-it-yourself do it yourself type person. There's all kinds of ideas in here. Really good magazine. Some of the stuff, I think, is just a little bit on the goofy side. But uh, most of the stuff is some really good knowledge. Very good ideas. I picked up uh, some reflective guy line. These were on clearance for a dollar a roll. It's 25 foot roll, so that's a pretty good idea. And this is something I'm super excited about. 22 Magnum. I haven't seen 22 Magnum on the shelves in over two years, so this this is awesome. I just happened to be walking through the sporting goods section, and I heard the lady talking about Magnums, and I looked over here in the shelf, and sure enough, there's some 22 Magnum on the shelf. These are uh, full metal jackets. I actually prefer those for hunting squirrels because with a, uh, a hollow point and 22 Magnum, you about blow them in half if you hit them in the body. If you hit them in the neck, you blow the head clean off with a hollow point. But uh, I like to use those tw those full metal jackets for hunting squirrels anyway. This is another really cool find. It's in a uh, Ozark Trail stainless steel three-piece cook set. I was just watching the video this morning of the uh, Kentucky Woodsman. He had, he had seen my Walmart grease pot and he made him one. And uh, that, was an, that was an idea I got off of YouTube a couple years ago. I can't remember whose channel I got it off of. This thing was only $9.88. That seemed like a really good price. This bag. It's got a two quart pot and a uh, it's almost a one and a half quart pot. <laughs> the lid has a little flip up handle, which is nice. It's not a little plastic handle you gotta worry about melting off. Feels really solid too. Not bad. And for 988, that is a heck of a deal. My stump's not level, that's why it's wobbly, it's not the pot. The lid is designed to, uh, to fit onto either pot. I've been looking at those the Stanley uh, Adventure Cook Set, the Cook Pot. They're like twenty-four dollars, and I just couldn't bring myself to spend twenty-four dollars on it. But, uh, for the price, this seems like an awesome deal. I'll probably end up doing a uh, a review video on this. Cook a little something later on. All right, guys. I appreciate y'all watching, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Kind of a snug fit getting them back in the bag. 
That'll work, especially for 988. That's, that's awesome. All right, thank y'all for watching. Yeah. Huh? Uh.